Hello everybody, Amardarn here. Hope you're having a good day today. I'm doing pretty good. We are in the shopping district. We're actually over by Fort's Gravel Shop. Um, Fort built this as a temporary place to sell his gravel and asked me to uh, build him a more permanent location. So we're going to be working on that today. Um, I've got quite a few ideas for it. I think it's going to be a pretty good build. Um, kind of simple build really we're gonna be basically building a medieval style office house type thing with a gravel pit surrounding it with a and we'll have a bridge that connects over the gravel pit to the house so we're gonna get that done and we're probably also gonna work on some roads a little bit um, so that people can get down here fairly easy and um, and, and just kind of start connecting things up here in the shopping district. So let's get started with that. All right, so the first thing I want to do is I kind of want to terraform this area a little bit. Um, we're also going to be moving uh, the, his gravel shop just a little bit. We're going to be putting it over here. Uh, let's get rid of this mushroom. And... Um, Let's tear this down just a bit. All right, so we have most of our terraforming done. There's a little bit here that I didn't get to because I kind of ran out of blocks. Uh, we'll have to uh, go get some uh, from the base a little bit here a little later, and we'll get that filled in because um, it'll look odd if we don't. Um, in the meantime, we're going to start building the house that uh, we plan on building. So let's put down my shulker boxes that have my goods in them. And the uh, first thing I want is some dark oak logs. Alright, so we're going to start fairly basic. Um... All right, so the road's going to be right about here. So I think we want the house right here. Let's start there. So one, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. And one, two, three. One, two, three. Whoops. It's only two. Three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right. And one, two, three. Okay. So the house is going to be a bit of an L shape, I believe. Uh, one, two, three. Let's go. Let's make it a little bit larger. Two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right, there we go. All right. So the next thing I want to do. Is I want to put down a bit of gravel um, around the house as a foundation. Fill this all in.
All right, so we have our foundation down for the uh, shop. Now we start building the walls up. One, two, three, four, five. All right, there is the framework for the shop. Now, since this is a shop instead of a house, I think we're going to put the front door right in here. Right, right, right here. Uh, we'll actually extend this out a little bit. One, two, three. There we go. One, two, three. So that we can put a bit of a porch on this thing. Actually, I think since this is basically going to be a porch here. Do that. All right. So we have the framework of the of the uh, building set up. Uh, we've got our foundation. We've got our walls. Um, now we need to put in the interior walls and start dividing it up. Um, I'm going to be using some oak planks for that. And I brought along some extra oak logs in case I needed them. As well as some oak stairs for windows. Alright, so we want a door here. Okay. Uh, window there. Window there, window there, and a window there, 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 and there. So let's get rid of these. Okay, so we need stairs for the bottoms of the windows. All right, so I have the walls built and the windows in the door, and I have the interior part of the ceiling done. I've got these dark oak logs that make up the rafters of the building, and then I have a uh, dark oak slabs that I've put in to make up the ceiling itself, and I've covered up the joints on the logs with these dark oak slabs. I think that actually kind of looks pretty good. It kind of gives it a, a you know, a connection point. Um, we used oak on the walls. It's pretty basic, um, but it makes it look all right. Uh, we have gravel for the floor, and, um, and we're probably going to get rid of these dark oak logs that we were using as kind of uh, spacers and to set our positioning. So that is the main frame of the house. Pretty simple, actually. Um, next, we are going to put on the roof. 
Uh, I need some ladders to get up to the top, so let me make some of those real quick. Uh, doesn't need to be anything major, but do need enough sticks to make a couple of ladders. So let's do that. Um, there we go. This is just to get us up to the top while we work on the roof. Alright, so I want some dark oak stairs. For the, for the uh, outline of the roof. There's another drowned. We've been running into a bunch of drowned as we uh, build here close to the ocean. But uh, nothing we can't handle right now. Those words might come back to haunt me. Alright, so let's get this down. Uh, we do want to put a roof over this. Okay, come over here and do the same on this side over here. And then this up here in front. Get this end over here. Always want to have an overhang if we can. I kind of like that. It was kind of accidental, but I like it. Um, hmm. And there, of course, on the ground. Let me finish the outline of the roof and then we'll decide whether or not we continue to do that. Alright, I have the frame of the roof put in. Now we just need to uh, put in the rest of the roof and uh, finish up the sides and then we can move on to the interior. And there we have our main structure. This is going to be the office. Now around it we're going to put a, a small kind of gravel pit. Um, which means we're going to have to cut back this hill a little bit more. Uh, we don't want to go too far because uh, we want to leave some space. And uh, we are going to go ahead and leave this mushroom here. Um, but we need to get rid of some stuff. Okay, so we have the gravel pit put together. Um, just there couple of last places here where we kind of want to fill things in maybe a little bit. Um, don't want to overdo it too much. Okay, there we go. There is our gravel pit. Now I want to build a bridge that connects the office to the other side over there. 
So let's get that done. We're gonna need some dark oak logs. So we'll grab some of those. All right, so here and there. Ah, uh, we want some stairs. Do we have any more spruce stairs? Yes, we got a few. All right, and we want some planks. Use some dark oak planks, I think. That'll work. All right. And we'll just go straight to there. I think that'll work fine. That there, and then uh, put some more planks across here. Get rid of this extra. Uh oh. I guess I haven't slept in a while. Let's go do that, and I'll be back. Take care of you, master phantoms. Alright, let's go back over here and finish. Oh, we need some fences. All right, now. Okay, so we have our fence, we have our quarry, we have our office, but there's one thing left. How does... All right, so we have our office and our bridge and our quarry. And I think we're almost finished. We just need to do the interior now and we'll be all set. So, um, we need a desk. Yeah, we need a chair. Let's put that chair a little closer. I also think we're going to change out the floor in there. Uh, we need some signs. And some chests. Alright, so let's Oh, 
while I like the idea of the gravel floor, it doesn't really fit for the interior. Let's fill in the holes. There we go. And then we'll slab it up. There we go. Nice set of slabs. Get some chests in here. that and we're gonna have to move this stuff inside all right so we're going to put the inner chest over there uh, we're going to put is a sand right there and his gravel right there there we go put a sign out here words gravel and sand bit There we go. And then he can set up the rest of the place the way he wants. We can do a little bit of interior decorating for him um, once everything is settled. Um, but I think for the most part, we are done. Pretty, pretty good build. Um, I like it. I think we're uh, set. And uh, we'll uh, get with Fort and see what he thinks. All right, folks, so I think I'm out of time for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, hope Fort likes his uh, new shop. And um, until next time, my name has been Amador. If you liked the video, please hit the like button. If you'd like to see more, hit the subscribe button. And until next time, you guys have a good one. Goodbye.